In the last one, I admitted I hadn't paid close enough attention to my game settings, and I had the game on Insanity. I have since confirmed that it was on Insanity, and I have since changed it again, and we are now on Warrior difficulty. We're no longer playing on uh, whatever it is before that. We're now on Warrior. So we got this baseball bat as a reward for the last quest we ran. I really wish I would have checked these before I did this. I am all about double looting, triple looting, quadruple looting those. Anyway, this is a restore power quest. We have a night quest on hand, and we're going to try to rip through this as quickly as possible using a flaming baseball bat, because that just makes sense to me. Sir! Also, sir. I'm not sure that these guys are... Uh, employees, but oh yeah, I am liking me a baseball bat. Look at all those head smashes. That is just, that is just a delight. Okay, uh, this is one of the ones we had to turn on. This is the one we got to turn on. I think we got rid of everyone in the neighborhood. Yeah, I know you're always going to break or you're often going to break at least once. That way you can draw all the zombies nearby. Joke's on you. I already have the zombie. At least the zombies in this area destroyed. So there's going to be one more. I'm going to check this desk here. And honestly, I really truly am just trying to rip through this. I'm not spending a whole lot of time here. I'm checking the trash because, hey, you never know. Right? Right. Okay. Let's just keep on ripping through this place. And I got to remember where we're supposed to go. Not that way. Not that way. Um... That's where we came in. Where are we supposed to go then? Is this one is this one of those double POIs where it's connected to something? I think it is, right? It's connected next door. There it is. I knew there was a switch here because I could have sworn this was the way to go. Yeah, we're gonna connect via the backyard over here. Sort of. We're gonna connect via the roof. How you doing? Hey! Don't be super strong now. I don't like that. I don't appreciate that. Uh, you know what? We'll go ahead and take the feather, too, because we might need to make some more arrows. We did find some... Brr. Right, let's just go ahead and make sure we fall over. We did find some arrow heads in the last one. But we didn't have the feathers at the time to make the arrows, so that was a thing. Bad dog. Bad. Bad dog. I now remember this building. I remember this from... I don't remember if it was the streamer weekend for Alpha 20, but I remember everyone dropping in here. Hi. I'm just trying to trigger everyone. Okay, let's do this. Here we go. This place is all nice and clean, minus this guy. How you doing? Crap! The trigger. It's a good thing I reloaded this one. Stay down. You stay down. You stay down. You're not dead yet. There we go. That's the clear. Let us turn on our last generator. And then we are done with this quest. Nope. Cancel. Okay. I'm going to very slowly take my time here with this guy because there's no need to panic. There's no need to rush. Alright, if you're just gonna... Oh, you're faking your death. That's what you're doing. Well, I'm gonna fake your existence. How about that? Haha! -ha! And stuff. I don't know. I got nothing. Okay. Ding! And when I say ding, I mean thunk because the game thunks. Oh! Buddy! Um, let's get you and you. I mean, we should probably think about investing in in clubs at this point because we got ourselves a pretty honking good baseball bat. I mean, seriously, a quality three bat. If I'm not mistaken here, I think we can put one more mod in there. We don't really have one more mod. I mean, technically... Uh, you know, it doesn't matter. You don't really need to be in there. I just kind of put it in there just for the giggles because we didn't really have room to put stuff. 
What are you up to now? 24.3 and 41.7 on the power attack. I'm feeling that. All I know is that I'm sure there's at least one person watching who enjoys a good baseball bat. Now, I'm not saying the flaming mod is, is the best or even my favorite mod for the baseball bat, but um, it's what we got, man. Guessing the chain or maybe the the wire is the better one. I think the chain adds more knockdown. And really the bat is all about control. That's that's what the clubs in general are about. They're just about control. Cat, speaking of control, you're like falling out of my lap. It's really weird. I have my all my weapons in a weird spot. Like this should actually be number two, but I think because I was using a cramp weapon. I had it on number five. I am insulted by those, so we're going to ignore them. And then we're going to modify you and put that Iron Breaker mod on that guy. And that's just going to get us out of this place. But are you actually dead? Okay, you're actually dead. Where's the final loot? I missed it. I don't know where it is. I, I missed it. But we do have some boxes to unlock. It's good that they're both popping pills. I'll take that. Ooh, bar brawler. Knock out your opponent with a sprinting power attack. You know, if we had all the bar brawling books, I'm... Now that I realize I'm no longer playing on insanity... Yeah, there it is. Duh. I might be willing to go fish to cuffs. Just saying. I... Ooh, that's not bad. I think that's a better that's a replacement over what we already had. I have done some uh, brawling builds before, and man, they're just a riot. You get some beer. You make sure you got all the books, of course. You get some beer, and you just go to town on everything. It is hilarious. Genuinely enjoyable. Like, it is super good. Uh... I'm going to say I'm going to stick with the quality four. I know that might not be the best idea. I just prefer the maneuverability, the speed, the stamina use, etc. of the light armor. Oh, someone dropped loot over here and gave us grandpa's awesome sauce. Well, don't mind if I do. I am happy to say we absolutely tore that quest to pieces. Thank you. Oh, go. goodness. A quality 3 AK. I think we have to. And then we have completed tier 2, and I don't know what the right play is. A cloth armor bonus bundle. That If there's good quality stuff in there, that might be more mod slots for us. A nail gun would be nice, but we're going to find nail guns left and right. I don't give the slightest crap about farming in this game. It's terrible now. And 50 forged iron, we can find that anywhere. I mean, I realize that's probably not the best choice there, but that's kind of my role, you know, to make terrible choices. I guess we could do one more tier two just to kind of, you know, I like you, friend. get it out of the way. And then do we have anything we need to sell to you? We do have some money. Sir, I would like to sell you some monies. There we go. We're almost at 17,000. That's not bad. I mean, here I've been thinking, I've been trying to figure out some of the things that we can leverage out of the mod. Come back, and one of the thoughts I had had was that we're going to take all of our 762 and we're just going to convert it to 9 mil. I don't know that we have enough to do that just yet, but that was kind of my plan. And maybe that's still the better play. Because we have all of the pistol books. We do have all the shotgun books, too. But we don't really have any of the, the books that are going to be beneficial for the machine guns. So maybe we'll still do that. It's just we got to kind of get to the point where we have enough ammo to do that. And we might now. I'm not sure. I haven't checked in a, in a minute. That guy was tough. I mean, lumberjacks are tough, so I get it. But that guy was tough. Let's drop off some stuff here. I'm going to put that away because it's the fire is kind of distracting to me. Like, seriously, it really kind of is. It's kind of annoying. 
Spear, you were a good, good time for a little while. Let's put that away. So we've only got 57 rounds. We're not quite ready to do what I was hoping to do, but... Oh, goodness. All right, let's check out this, this cloth armor bundle we got, and we'll see if this has anything good in it. Wow. I am so in on that. You have no idea. Seriously. That is spectacular. I realize it's only... Oh. Let me just beat you in the back of the skull if that's what you're going to do. I mean, look, I get it. It's cloth armor. It's not the best stuff in the world. I mean, we're literally talking about the weakest armor in the game. The weakest proper armor in the game. But, dude, all of these mod slots are just spectacular. I just, I am so, so pleased with this. You have no idea. So going through all of our mods, let me resort. And I just realized I have to reset the slot locking every time I open the game. So note to self, do that. Let's go ahead and put the, let's see, we've got, where did everything go? Oh, we can't put the helmet light in the hood. I remember that now. Okay, so we still need to roll with this guy because I definitely want to keep the helmet lit up but we can put uh, one of these guys in there one of those guys in there and the gloves we can put uh, i don't know sure one of those guys in there one of those guys in there and then the leg armor we can put uh, one of those and one of those because i don't know that just sounds good padded boots we'll put that in there and honestly i'm pretty pleased with that i'm gonna drop this one in the box there because i don't want to lose that We'll go ahead and make some more iron arrows, just because it's not a bad idea to have a few of those ready to go. And then we don't need that anymore. I scrapped a hood, by the way, in case you're wondering. A plant fiber hood, if you're wondering where the green stuff came from, that's why. And then this leaves us with the next thing I, I think we probably need to do. Oh man, we need to invest in this. Now, technically, we could go up to Tinkerer by spending only a few points, but we don't really need the workbench. What we need right now is the forge, because I want to get started on stuff. We also need to expand this place. So, uh, what do we have for materials right now? Not a lot. Really need to do... need, 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 uh, need to get a chainsaw or something. Uh, let's let's not worry about expansion right now. Actually, no, let's worry about expansion right now. I want to... Maybe I put this in the wrong place. I don't remember. Okay, I'm going to do this super ugly and bare bones. And it's going to be okay. That's basically it right there. And we need to get rid of this guy. I'm kind of curious if we're going to see... Anyone wandering today? Any sort of wandering horde? I imagine we will. And I don't know what time they they arrive. I haven't paid close attention to that. I thought it maybe it was kind of morning. Have we not checked this car? Why haven't we checked this car? Did it respawn? I turned off loot spawning. It's only been six days, so it shouldn't have. Okay. Whatever. Um, back to this stuff. Do we have what we need... Or a forge. I don't even remember what we need these days. I know we need some clay. We got a bunch of clay. We need leather, duct tape, and short iron pipes. Leather, short iron pipes. We don't have duct tape. We don't really have glue. We might need to make some glue here. So, you know, let's do some ductile tape. Duct tape. Let's make maximum duct tape. And then this guy, we're going to cook up some glue here. Oh, yeah, that's right. We need the murky stuff. Been trying to make sure we have some of that just for times like these. I'll do five of those guys. I don't necessarily want to go through all of the stuff we have. So we can now do a forge. Remember when you had to do the bellows and all that stuff independently? Speaking of, we don't have bellows, so we can't do that. Oh, I should have worn this because that would have made things go faster. Hey, okay, we should have a forge ready to go. I'm cooking up some bacon and eggs right now. And let's see, let's, uh, which direction do we want this to be facing? Probably that one. 
I realize this is really stupid, but like I said, I'm doing this super bare bones right now because I don't feel like dealing with things. So we still need an anvil. That's going to be a problem because if we wanted to do bullet tips, which we're going to need, I think we can get away with some of this stuff. So let's just start loading this guy up with... Uh, here, let's do half of our clay because I don't want to do all of it just yet. And then... Trying to think what's going to be more... Maybe 18 of these guys versus 7? No, I think, it, I think it would be the other way. That's fine. We'll just turn that on and we'll let that start to kind of add some stuff in there. And then eventually what we're going to do is make some bullet tips and some casings. And once we have all of those, we're going to make a few bullets with the meager amount of gunpowder we have. So we're going to probably need to do some digging and find some gunpowder because, uh, you know, some nitrate and all that jazz. We'll just have to make some and it'll be okay. But yeah, it's going to end up being a thing. So while that is cooking, we're going to go ahead and make... Um, I don't know what we need to make. I guess just a bunch of survivor notes is what we need. Because I don't think we really need any of those mods right now. We'll just go ahead and crank out a bunch of survivor notes with the... All of the... <laughs> make a bunch of collection of notes with all these survivor notes we have. And then, I don't know. Let's see. What can we do with these guys? We can do some treasure maps. Which there is still a part of me that wants to do that. But not enough to really go crazy with that. And we could do the Survivor's Diary, which, um, we could do some books. I wouldn't mind grabbing the rest of the mining books if we're going to have to do some mining. Although the thing is, now that we found that bat, I don't think I really need the pistol as much anymore. That's kind of the funny thing. Like, intentionally chose a class that's going to lean on pistol, and yet you find a good weapon... Let's just take the skill points. It's fine. I mean, maybe once we get these guys, we'll worry about not skill pointing them. I'm, I'm not sure. But the whole thing is, now that we have other means of killing things, and I also don't have it on insanity, I don't know that I really need the pistol as much, which I do want to lean into it. Don't get me wrong. The plan is to still lean into it, but I'm kind of okay if it takes just a little bit longer to get to that point. And I'm still fine with just buying a bunch of ammo because, really, it's just going to be, like, time and annoyance on my part to have to go dig around and mine with crappy weapons and no skills. But that's in part why I'm using all of these. You're not interested in that? Oh, because it's, it's destroyed. That's why. Got it. You know, it's cool. Whatever. And safe travels, uh, I forget. Do you have anything we care about? I mean, we could buy the 762 and then convert it. But I'm really not so inclined to do that. Do you have gunpowder? Gunpowder would be good. We can buy all the gunpowders. I think that is a really strong idea. Is buy a crap ton of gunpowder. Because then we can just make our own ammo without having to go mining and stuff all day long. So I'm going to do something right quick Save now battles. that we have some points in here. I'm going to go and knock one into better barter. And I realize I should have done that beforehand. I know that. But now I want to see what he's got in his inventory. I guess it didn't change yet. That's fine. That's fine. Be seeing you. Can we go... I don't know if we can go one more. I don't think we can, right? We still we need to get up to three... Uh, we're going to do that eventually anyway, just probably for other things. But I don't want to do that just yet. I want to do something like run and gun. Because that's going to reduce the penalty when reloading. If you can sprint and reload, oh, it's so good. It really is good. And then I wouldn't mind leaning a little more into that as well. But we probably need to put some points over here. I mean, we kind of do have one over here for uh, a point in sledge. If we can find better sledges, I'm I'm good with with taking that back again. Here, let's do this guy because that's going to be a good one. We'll just put one point in there, 
And then we're going to knock another point into Perception. Just because that's going to pay dividends when it comes to other things. Then we'll go ahead and put another one into Lucky Looter. And you know what? There you go. Just like that, we have spent a bunch of skill points. Some of those by way of the diary. So I'm, I'm really pleased with that. We're going to dive into one more POI just because I feel kind of bad. I've spent all day just sitting in inventory. And that's just... I don't know, that's not very fun to watch. So, I mean, necessary stuff, don't get me wrong. Or at least good intention stuff. So, you know, rhyme and reason, but... Oh, I forgot to see if there was a better mod than the flaming burning shaft mod for the, the, the baseball bat here. Totally forgot. My oh, bad. That's right, I'll check when we get back to base again. Okay. You are dead. I'm going to put that away because I think the, the fire is also crap on frame rate. And this game does not run well, even with like, I don't know. I've never figured out how to get this game to run the way I want it to run. It always runs poorly, no matter what I do, no matter what hardware I have. All the things. And sometimes it's POI dependent, and I get that. But I don't know. It just, uh, it's not great. Part of it is just, you know, voxels and a bajillion calculations and all those things. But just the same. Like in here, it's, I don't know, it just keeps dropping under under 60, which is just stupid because there's like no, no real rhyme or reason for that as far as I'm concerned. And we'll go ahead and eat that. That'll give us some hydration back. And I'm not worried about stacking buffs or anything right now. It's fine. Check the shoe pile, though. Um, I don't like that die, so I'm not into it. It's fine. Oh, that I want. Because I've been wanting to make some pocket mods, but I don't want to use the only two. Like, literally, we just found two. But the only two sewing kit needle thing threads we have. I haven't wanted to do that, because that seems like such... Maybe not the best to use in the early game, because if we get hit... I need to be able to stitch that up. My bad. You're not dead? No, you're dead. <laughs> ah! Gosh, I love it. I just love it. Nothing says fun like a running baseball bat to the face. I just wish that the baseball bat had more of a horizontal swing and less of a diagonal swing. I mean, I realize it's more horizontal when you're doing the power attacks. This is the weak attack. But it's still not as horizontally as I want it to be. I realize that's not really a word. Uh, where is the thing we're supposed to get? It's upstairs. Okay. Completely forgot we were supposed to find a thing. My bad. We'll go find that in a second. Give me a car mod. Actually, that is not bad. I will take that. Uh, Metal Spikes mod. You know what? Let's modify you, take that out, and put that in its place. So those are going to lower the enemy's armor, potentially. I mean, I still don't really know what that actually means. I don't know. I just don't want to deal with the fire because it's kind of obnoxious. Maybe, oh, you know what? I do want that. I'll take that back. Maybe I'll put it back on, uh, you know, the stone axe. Bonk. I think that guy is toast. I love that sound. The really high-pitched one. It's fantastic. Bink! It's so good. Okay. I'll, I'll meet you back at the trader because I, I gotta get I gotta track this stupid thing down. Oh man, I, I forget every single time I come back at eleven, traders close. And it's funny because I was gonna say I should have said, ah, we can we can turn this quest in later. It's fine. And you know what? We're gonna turn it in later. It's fine. I'm gonna drop off all the stuff. I should tell you that I did find one more survivor note. It was inside of the house that we were just in. It was in the mailbox. So 
We have an extra one if you're wondering how and why. That's how. That's why. And we'll rejoin on the next one as we, I don't know, maybe go to a different place. I think maybe uh, we should go to that other town that we've that we've opened up over here and see if there are any places we want to hit. Never mind if there are any still in this one that we've kind of ignored because of low level and all that jazz. Whatever. We'll figure that one out on the next one. Till then, thanks for watching. See you later.